Okay, in this tutorial we're going to draw some lines for the first time and we're going to kind of draw them freehand, as I'd like to say. Alright, so let's get started. The line command is up here on the ribbon under the Home tab. Um, pretty obvious, it's right here in the left hand corner. So what you're going to do is pick on that and I want you to notice that the command line um, actually on the bottom line here it's telling us what to do it's saying that the line command has been executed and it wants us to specify the first point alright now we're gonna do that with the mouse so I'm just gonna bring my mouse into the drawing area and just left pick okay with the mouse and then you'll notice that it wants to start to draw a line and at this point I can really pick anywhere that I want um, in the drawing area so I'm gonna pick again all right, and anytime you hear me say pick, I mean left mouse, or even click would mean left mouse. All right, and we're just going to draw lines by picking and moving the mouse. Okay, you don't want to drag the mouse with that left mouse button down like you would if you were dragging a pencil on paper. Okay, it's, it's not like that. What you want to do is actually pretend like you're stitching fabric. You're just going to pick, move the mouse, and pick, okay? Now when you're done picking and you want to end the line command, all you have to do is an enter. And um, the right click on our mouse has been set to also mean enter. So I'm going to do a quick right click, okay? And you'll notice um, that executed the enter command and if you look at the command line now the com the line command is over okay so let's just try that one more time I'm gonna do an undo I'm gonna go up to the line command it starts the line command on the command line I'm gonna pick 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 a couple of times here and then I'm gonna right click to end the line command 